Hey everybody, this is Cameron with Groove Master Academy. I'm here with my feline overlords, Heart of Darkness and Heart of the Sky, in the Galactic Library band room. <laughs> uh, if you want to skip this part and get right to the meat of the video, check the timestamps and you can go right there. This is a long delayed follow up to the first scientific approach to improving right hand improvisation. Okay, to track our progress here, we are describing the kind of line we're going to play, or what we're going to, chords we're going to play over, and then here we have the number of possible notes that we can hopefully get right in each one. So, let's take a look at that first line, and there we have the uh, 251 lick borrowed from Bird, and... You can count the notes, it adds up to 21 in the shaded areas there. And this is the second 251 we're going to pull out for this part of the tune, this section of the video. Alright, let's go to the tape and see how we did on the first run. So I got off to a slow start here, I to play that minor 7 twice. Here we go. Okay, that was good, but fell apart right there. <laughs> so I got it through. That. Yeah, I got the bebop dominant scale in on that G7. And not bad on the major 7 chord. Okay, so throw away chord and then. Alright, once again, I got the first measure and then pretty much nothing. Not bad on the. Yeah, I got the bebop scale in on that dominant, so that's okay. Okay, so in the interest of actually completing something like this video, I'm just going to strip it down and take a look at those first two two five ones, and I'm going to give myself only eight points on each one. Um, because I only got the first um, eight notes, the two, and then fell apart. Uh, that was recorded about eight, uh, nine days ago on the 8th, and i um, been practicing every day, which is why I'm doing this. And it's already a lot better, so I'm going to keep this project up and track the progress. Um, I'm doing this because this is the kind of thing I wish someone had taught me a long time ago. So if this is helpful to you and get anything out of it, or you can give a way I could do it better that would help you more. Um, that's why I'm doing this, to help and to build a community. So I would genuinely appreciate any comments if you have any. Okay, and uh, if you got something out of it, subscribe would be nice too. Or helpful. Thanks, this is Cameron. Talk to you later. Bye.